end and it tries to transfer tokens. It uses the transfer form function. We're already familiar with it in ERC20 to transfer this amount of tokens that was provided as parameter from the message sender to this smart contract. Now it takes the return value and if it did not succeed, it reverts the transaction. So we need to approve the contract before to spend our tokens before we call either this deposit collateral or this deposit, co deposit collateral and mint DSE tokens. Now, this is another issue because USDT token, uh, I don't know if you're familiar with it, but it's a token that does not return any value. It doesn't follow the ERC20 standard, which means that the transfer form value does not return any value. And by default, if we get this return value, this Boolean, and this does not return anything, this is always gonna be false. Because if it doesn't return anything, we're gonna get here by default false. So even though the, the transfer of the UCD token succeeded, still this success Boolean will be false, which means that if at some point, this engine will want to deploy and support USDT tokens. You cannot add collateral tokens to the, to the protocol, but you can deploy it with other tokens, right? Currently deploy, deployed with wrapped ETH and wrapped DTC, but maybe they will want to deploy it later on with USDT as well, or they will want to deploy it on another chain with USDT. And in that case, this deposit collateral will always revert, which means that no one will be able to deposit USDT to this smart contract. And the solution is to use safe transfer lib because safe transfer lib is a library by open zeppelin which you can use you can wrap your irc uh, as a interface with this and then you can use instead of transfer form you can use safe transfer form that actually checks if the transfer form function has a return value and only if it has a return value it's gonna um and it was false it's gonna revert the transaction so th this is the way to overcome this issue and this is a valid medium issue in my opinion this is a, one of the issues that i reported and we can also already go to the issues and you can see here as medium usdt can never be supported by the protocol right because and here i explain everything that i explained to you because it's non upgradable and it doesn't allow additional ad supported token but it can be deployed with usdt as collateral supported collateral token in that case usdt won't uh, won't work because of this issue and the recommendation is to use safe transfer and safe transfer from instead of just manually checking the return value and validating that it's it's true